guys already ready to punch each other in the face and this is this is where we're starting here so bear with us we're getting spargo versus sinji we got cloud versus pac-man and right out of the gate starting here on pokemon stadium 2 let's see what's gonna happen now sinji did pretty solid against cola it was like it was a 2-1 set it was definitely close sinji very very good at handling the limit so when spargo gets limit i wonder what sinji's gonna do here is he is spargo gonna charge in or is sinji gonna just make it so he can't sinji's probably gonna try to wall him out to yeah. force him to either wait too long for limit or to force him to use it well limit is on deck right here and here he is using the trampoline trying to get the heck out of here and he's holding his shield gonna get out and yep. there it goes so spargo actually unlike cola shooting the limit out a little bit earlier but that bell in the forward smash is going to do a lot of damage. Man, this is, this is... This is this is already getting here. Sinji looks very comfortable in this matchup. Seems to know it pretty well. He's, you know, walling out Cloud where he can and using his projectiles to block all, all of his game plan. To force him into to weird options and situations. Yeah, and I'm, I'm actually very excited to see what happens if Sinji gets, uh, gets Spargo off stage. But as it is right now, percents are climbing back up. Spargo got the edge guard situation. And we have seen Spargo get some pretty crazy two frames, so. Yeah, he gets some pretty good two frames. And on top of that, he seems to have a really, really good um, blood trapping game. And seems to really force pressure on the opponent to really try to make a, a good option off the ledge. And Otherwise, you're going to get punished for there it. There it is again, where Sinji actually making it so Spargo burns the whole entire limit. And Spargo getting the heck out of ledge. That was definitely risky. Forward up smash, almost connecting. Not going to do it. And these percents are extremely high. Climbing. Ooh. Climbing, climbing. Ooh, he gets the dash attack. Uh, Sinji seems to constantly be using the fire hydrant to try to do something. Spargo just picked up on that and was like, yep, this is it. All right, right here, we got limit on cloud here. Sinji already taking another 50%. Almost getting spiked there. Oh, and he catches the rolling. Wow, that death? what a read. What a read. Not yet. God, this is... You're seeing just what Spargo's doing here. He's going in hard. He's got momentum. He definitely does. And back air coming in from Cloud. Limit on deck. Almost. But gets a spike. Yep. Oh, we've, seen, wow. we've seen Spargo get these spikes like crazy. He's got it down. I mean, to be fair, he's been doing it for quite a while now. All right, Hydrant out, 160 right now. God, Sinji, like, it's not that Sinji's not doing damage. Spargo's just not dying. He's getting those clean hits. He's not trying to force, you know, a kill or anything. He's, but that is going to take it there. there. The opening. Let's, let's see what happens here. Sinji's got a lot of work to do. But we also know we've seen Sinji do this to Bola, where if he gets Cloud off stage, that could be death. That could be death from a cherry. Yeah. It could be death from Cloud a is orange. If there's, there's options. <laughs> Cloud gets gimped super easily, so you just gotta get him off stage. Just the number one thing against the matchup, you know. Yeah, and back end does a back end does a good job with that. But we got the got the item over here, and he can see. Spargo knows the matchup really well. Yeah, Spargo seems pretty comfortable in this. All right, limit is still on deck, and I thought he was gonna use it. You're seeing Sinji's getting the heck out of dodge, and there it is, burning the limits. Wow. Woo. <laughs> That was what something. What a game. What a game. That was something there. Spargo taking game one. Awesome. That was that was a good good first game that we saw coming out there. Very excited to see what else will make its way. I'm gonna. Well, I wonder how Sinji's gonna react and adapt to um, his oppressive, you know, pressure. Spargo's really got those backers on shield really well, and those and kind of knows how to time it and change the timing and mixing up all all of his approaches. Yeah, it we'll, seems to really give Sinji a lot of trouble. We'll definitely have to see here. Good stuff that we are seeing coming out from these players. All right, getting into game two. We're going to have the players on the other sides now, and let's get into it here.
So, are we going back to PS2? I don't think so. I think Sinji really wants to bring this. All right, get into a bigger stage yeah, here. Going to be a lot stage. harder for uh, for Cloud to find his way in. Let's see what goes on. Again, like this is where, like, if oh. any of those hits hit, it would have been kind of it. But Sparkle keeping the pressure here. Yeah. Oh my wow. gosh, how many down airs has this guy landed? Like, it's just a lot. Every every time he throws out a down air, he seems to just get that sweet spot. Got Sinji getting the heck out of there, almost getting hit by that up smash. Good air dodge. And he's got the limit, but you see Sinji's just going to stall it out here. No real weight using that to deal with it. Limit's going to burn out. There it is. Sinji doing really playing the cloud matchup correctly, making that limit burn. You, you really have to. It's really his one of his best kill options in general. That, that's On top funny. of that, you see Spargo not forcing an option to try to use limit. He realized, you know, like, I'm not going to get a chance to use it. Let's just, you know, get hits and strings in where we can. And Sinji actually, again, like, doing some really good stuff here. But Spargo, his down airs are really the difference that we're seeing between Cola and, and what Sinji's been doing here. Dude, Sinji's not handling these down airs nearly as crazy. Good bell, not going to take the stock bell. Oh man, let, oh, me, wow. let me catch the orange, let me hit the hydrant, and let me kill you. That is exactly what happened. He's done a hitbox, really. Did, a, did that one in, for sure. Gosh. Let's go and see if Sinji's gonna get this stock sooner rather than later. I mean, again, any damage. And I love it how, like, yeah, Pac-Man's up build definitely is specific, but when it hits, it does lead into combos and everything. Oh yeah. All right, good. Gets it, but doesn't punish the getup attack. Could have done, uh, could have done maybe an up smash or something. Pac-Man's one of those characters where you watch them and when they're playing really well. It's sometimes it's crazy. you don't even know what's going on because they're they're trying to do these crazy setups and and th things oh I didn't even gosh. know. I didn't know fruit reacted some ways with Hydrant and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of crazy. crazy. It is kind of crazy. It's it's funny. I remember. Oh my gosh, another dare kill. What the heck? He is on fire with those dares. Every dare he puts out, he always gets that sweet spot. Yeah, always like, leaving something. Like, as you were saying, Pac-Man is really feeling it, and they, they make their own Twitter clips. But but we're seeing these cloud dares just coming in hard. Hydrant coming oh, in. Says, Not oh. going to kill. Not going to kill. 170. Wow, great DI. Uh-oh. And there the it is. The pressure is amazing. Still keeping here, but forward tilt. Not going to take it. Setting up the hydrant. Setting up the trap. That's scary. Oh my gosh. They, if that were an inch closer, that would have hit him on ledge. But is he pretty contested? <laughs> oh my wow. god. Let me just grab you through the hydrant, okay? If you were to tell me that that was the option, I would have said, I don't believe you. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Oh man. As it is though, Sinji getting some good damage here, oh. but still has a huge hill to climb. 100% already on Sinji. He's just got to be careful of his, you know, his ledge cards and those dares. Oh he's my gosh! Them every time, that was very close. Super scary with those up B's. I mean, you're seeing Sparkle between the dares and the up B's have been just punishing Sinji's Sinji's approaches in sometimes. Very, very good. Like this going across nice the stage, and the that's it. Oh no, he's got his jump. But yeah, that's it. That is it. Okay. That oh. is it. <laughs> that's a rough spot to be in as Cloud. So yeah, now let's see what happens here because 150. Should you can bring this back really easily? You as we oh, as we say that. There's the up. As we say that, getting getting a sword into butt. Man, game two going here to Spargo. Spargo's just really putting up the pressure, and it just seems like Cindy doesn't know how to handle it all the time. He seems to be overwhelmed at some points. <clears throat> Dang, good stuff here. Good stuff that we're seeing here. And it looks like they are running it right back. They want in. All right, then. Let's get game three here. Spargo versus Sinji. Sinji wants this game. He definitely wants us to keep going. There, these guys have traveled sure, through sure. losers. Right back to town and city. And like that, gonna take it off there, but... Yeah, I mean, this is rough. Like, you beat one of the clouds, and then you got another cloud. You're just like, what What has changed? Because clearly these players are, are very different in how they have do just decision-making. Oh, my gosh. Oh, for sure. 
Sparger's definitely used it to his advantage that, that Senji seems to not really know how to deal with all, you know, how long the sword is. Some of the disjoints and how he's using it is much different must be than Cola because he's not catching on to how he's approaching with it. Yeah, I mean, I, I definitely agree. It's it's very, very interesting. Oh my gosh, did he just use what the a, limit to do it? Oh man. Cloud? Edge guarding? I've never heard of it. I mean, that deep? No. Sergeant Pickle, we see you there in the chat, and yeah, you're seeing a pretty crazy match coming on right now. This is this is something else. Seems you catching the jump, but that third up air just missing. Not, yeah, not really getting much out of it. Now, Sinji's probably gonna set up a, a trampoline and just make it so that. Here he goes. Oh, but he does get hit by the. Oh. oh. Stops him from approaching. That was really smart. Well, Sinji again having a hydra in the back airs. He's gotten away with those like six times now. So. Oh my god. <laughs> Maybe I should start playing Pac-Man because like <laughs> I'm just looking at the stuff they do. It's like, yeah, it's a fun kind of you just you just kind of use math sometimes. Uh-oh. Oh man. Jeez. Wow. I'm surprised he didn't break earlier. Alright, back throw gonna set up. And again, it's struggle gonna get another down air here. Oh that's gonna hurt. Oh no, I'm just gonna even yep, if he tech that, that was that was still gonna hurt. I think uh, I think maybe if he di down, he could have been able to tech that, but that that definitely was strong. Like this, Fargo on Very fire, good. about to send Shinji out of this tournament. What is gonna happen here? Oh wow, his up air strings are Woo! good Whoa! stuff. Shinji. Good stuff. That was a really good apple there. Uh oh. Is he gonna hit? Him? He tried. He definitely oh, wanted it. Man. He really wanted it. He was really feeling it. I think the simple thing here is that Spargo has been doing such a good job on not getting edge guarded. He has really made it so Sinji hasn't been able to get him off the edge. For sure, for sure. His, his lead trap game is really good. He's trying to keep center, center stage control the entire time, forcing him to, to you know always have the advantage. Yeah, we're just we're kind of seeing that here. Oh, all right. Gonna let it rip. Oh, he's gonna just. All right, he's gonna blade beam. He's only got like five seconds. Oh, I thought he was I just he gonna. Was to force. I thought he was gonna say screw it and just like up B out there. I was thinking about that. <laughs> yeah. It's like you got another you stock. You, you got another yeah. two games. <laughs> oh man, that's bad. Oh, okay. <laughs> that could be. Wow. That was really great positioning on Sinji's part. Now are we gonna see regular cross slash oh, for wow. the kill? Regular cross slash. Oh my gosh, Spargo already taking a full oh, here. Oh, dang. That was a really insane game, or even games in general. That was a really good set. Yeah, that was that was good overall. Good job for Sinji for really uh, you know pressing up against Spargo and really trying to take back and getting the you know the few string hits he could he could get. It just wasn't enough. Yes, Fargo is indeed going to move on in this bracket. Good stuff across the board here. Congrats, Sinji, on your seventh placement.